Hello everybody and today we are going to learn how to compress files. Most people already know this and if you don't, well you have made your first right step on the road to learning how to do Alright so, there's those programs that you can download but there's two what I prefer and I think suit this task better. Alright, but first, um, I would download Adblock for Google Chrome first, just so you have last chance of getting a virus. You won't probably get a virus by downloading this, but I'm gonna use Adblock. I'm gonna make a video where you can see where you're gonna get Adblock and all that. I put a link in the description below. Click on it and then come back to this video. But if you already got Adblock or you're gonna risk it, alright, let's get started. So first I'm gonna do elite unzip. So you can either put it into Google, elite unzip, or look in description and there'll be a link. Alright, so all you need to do is click on the free download button. Then you need to add. What I've been added to Chrome. And it also Alright, so this is what we need. We need the setup thing. You don't really need it into Chrome here, you probably want to go into your settings. So you go into settings here. You want to run at. You want to run this. Yes. Disable. I, I would disable it so now when you do this, you get your nice home pairs again. Alright, so you compress your files and it should be down here somewhere. Maybe here. I'm just watching someone underneath always oh, just need to ask all this off alright so it should already be downloaded blah 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 so maybe here we go it's here elite unzip so now you have your files success um, let's see this file here this is a uncompressed file you can tell by the zip file here all you need to do is drop it in it will decompress it and then you can throw your folder and all the stuff in it you can now use and it's as easy as that now onto the second software what you can use I use this software this one what I just showed you how to use but I used to use this software now it's this WinRAR it's most popular software for decompressing files now I'm gonna put a link in the description so just click there however it comes up with this a massive title, you know, blah blah blah, English, Chinese, Dutch. Well, it's really complicated. Alright, so first thing you want to do is go into your control panel. Is this for Windows 7? For Fist and all that, it might be different. But if you already you should already know. Mine's 64 bit. Is this what we want to look at? 32 bit, 64 bit. So you scroll down and where you can see that system type, 64 bit operating system that's what we want to know and then you find your language mine's English and I want a 64 bit so I'm going to download this and then I want to click yes browse find a good place I'm going to put it in my expansion drive you install it takes a buddha buddy boot it's all done alright so you can click on all these files what you'll compress with Add add to desktop, add to start my new blah blah blah. Okay. Done. Now both programs are free, but WinRAR after you get a 30 day trial and after that 30 day trial this thing will keep popping up but you can still use it for free. And WinRAR is simply this. So all your folders are here, you can open up all the folders what needs decompressing. And it's as easy as that. Once you download thing, you'll have an option you'll have to choose A or B. And that's is it. Easy peasy. Now you can download any file you want. Click on my next video to see how to download U-Tone. And U-Ton is also like a decompressing thing. It will help you get files for my Pirate Bear and all stuff like that. So until next time, hope I have helped. 
Now go decompress your files.